Porsche's CEO claims their groundbreaking hydrogen combustion engine is set to outshine electric vehicles. Boasting superior performance, he hints at a game-changing revelation that could revolutionize the automotive landscape. Will this innovation truly spell the end for EV dominance? Or is it just a bold bluff? The race for the future accelerates. In the exciting world of cars, finding new ways to power them is like searching for a legendary treasure, the Holy Grail. Imagine a world where cars can zoom around without relying on traditional fuels like petrol or diesel. This is the quest for alternative fuel sources in the automotive industry. Enter Porsche, a famous brand known for its super fast and luxurious cars. Guess what? They're diving into the search for these new ways to power cars. It's like seeing a superhero join a mission to save the planet. Porsche is not just about speed and fancy rides. They're also becoming champions of cleaner, greener energy for cars. Instead of just sticking to the old-fashioned fuel, they're exploring innovative options. It's like Porsche is saying, hey, let's find a better eco-friendly way to fuel our awesome cars. So, in the big book of automotive adventures, Porsche is adding a thrilling chapter, the pursuit of the holy grail of alternative fuel sources. Get ready for a ride where fast cars meet a cleaner, brighter future. Porsche's big boss, Oliver Bloom, just spilled the beans on something super cool, a hydrogen combustion engine. Forget the usual hydrogen fuel cells. This is like a new superhero version. Why is it so awesome? Well, hydrogen packs a powerful punch of energy, and when it gets used in this engine, it doesn't belch out yucky stuff. Just clean water vapor. In a paradigm shift for the automotive industry, Porsche is embracing environmental responsibility by revolutionizing its traditional car engine. Departing from conventional gas consumption, the innovative design now allows the vehicle to run on hydrogen, a game-changing leap towards sustainability. Enthusiastically championed by Mr. Bloom, this eco-friendly initiative marks a significant stride in the race for greener transportation. The brilliant concept not only demonstrates Porsche's commitment to a cleaner future, but also addresses air pollution concerns with a remarkable solution. Now, instead of emitting noxious fumes, the hydrogen-powered engine releases nothing more than a benign puff of water vapor, signaling a promising era for conscientious driving. This news is like telling everyone, Hey, we found a way to make cars go vroom without the planet going ouch. It's like a high-tech bedtime story for Earth, clean, cool, and ready for a happily ever after. In the past, BMW and Mazda tried some experiments with using hydrogen to make cars go zoom zoom. But, guess what? Porsche, the car experts, did something super special and different. Porsche isn't just trying things out like the others. Nope. They want to be the kings and queens of the car world by doing two cool things. Going really fast and being kind to the planet. Imagine driving a car that's like a superhero fast and eco-friendly. Porsche isn't just about showing off. They want to be the rulers of the road. They're not just making cars that work. They're making cars that make your heart race with excitement. Plus, they care about the earth, so it's like having a supercar with a green cape. Picture this. You sit in a Porsche, feel the wind in your hair, and know you're not hurting the planet. It's not just a ride. It's a happy adventure that's good for you and the world. That's the Porsche way. Fast, fun, and friendly to our home Earth. While many folks believe electric vehicles, EVs, are the perfect answer to our environmental concerns, let's dig a bit deeper. One worry is about the batteries that power these EVs. Making and disposing of these batteries can be harmful to the environment. The process of mining materials for batteries can damage ecosystems, and recycling them is not a breeze. Moreover, the technology in batteries still has some hurdles to jump. They don't last forever, and replacing them can be pricey. Imagine if your phone battery gave up after a few years, and you had to buy a whole new phone. Also, producing electricity for these EVs might not be as green as it seems. If the power comes from dirty sources like coal, it adds a different shade to the eco-friendly picture. In essence, while EVs have their perks, they're not the silver bullet we might think. We need to find ways to improve battery tech, be mindful of their environmental impact, and ensure the electricity charging them comes from cleaner sources. It's like solving a puzzle. The solution isn't just one piece, but many that need to fit together. Switching to new technologies has effects on more than just machines. Think about countries working together and how they get things like oil from each other. If we use less of this imported oil, it changes the way countries depend on each other. Some might become more independent, which can be good or tricky. But there are some tricky parts to this change. One example is making hydrogen, which is a big deal in these new technologies. Right now, 
it's not very efficient, meaning it takes a lot of effort to get it. Also, we need to set up new things like places to store and transport hydrogen. Imagine, if your favorite game suddenly had new rules, it's a bit like that for the world when it tries to use new energy methods. We have to figure out these new rules and make everything work together. So, when we talk about new technologies, it's not just about machines. It's like a big puzzle where each piece affects the others, and we're figuring out how to make the picture right. Porsche's future plan is like a big change in how cars work. They talk about making cars in a way that's good for the environment. They say it's a special moment in the talk about sustainability, which means doing things that don't harm the Earth. Porsche is really excited about using something called a hydrogen combustion engine. This is like the heart of the car, and it's powered by hydrogen, which is a clean and green gas. They think this engine is not just about being good for the Earth, but it's also like a special feeling or meaning for people who love cars. They want to show that cars can be cool and exciting, but also not hurt our planet. So Porsche is like a leader, showing the way for other car companies to follow. It's not just about driving, it's about a new way of driving that's good for nature and makes people feel something special. This is what Porsche sees as the path forward. Making cars that are awesome and kind to the Earth at the same time. Porsche faces challenges in technology, infrastructure, and how people behave as consumers. For technology, it means dealing with new and complicated stuff. Infrastructure challenges involve the systems and structures needed for things to work smoothly. Consumer behavior means understanding how people act when they buy and use products. Porsche's plan connects with what's happening in the bigger industry. Toyota and Hyundai are also investing in hydrogen fuel cell technology. It's like they're putting money into a special kind of technology that uses hydrogen to power cars in simpler terms. Porsche is dealing with tricky tech and making sure everything works well. Meanwhile, big companies like Toyota and Hyundai are also putting money into a cool way to power cars using hydrogen. It's like everyone is trying to figure out the best ways to make cars better for the future. In the exciting world of cars, Porsche is shaking things up. They're not just sticking to electric cars, they're bringing back hydrogen-powered engines. This means in the future, you won't only see electric cars zooming around, but also cars running on hydrogen power. Why is this a big deal? Well, it's like having more flavors of ice cream to choose from. Just like you can pick between chocolate and vanilla, soon you might be able to choose between electric and hydrogen cars. This gives you more options, and everyone loves having choices. Electric cars have been getting a lot of attention lately, but Porsche is saying, Hey, let's not forget about hydrogen. It's like having two superheroes instead of just one. Imagine if you could have Iron Man and Captain America. That's how it feels for car enthusiasts with both electric and hydrogen options. This move by Porsche is like opening a door to a future where different types of cars peacefully share the road. So, whether you prefer the silent power of electric engines or the futuristic kick of hydrogen combustion, the car world is getting ready for a diverse and exciting ride. Porsche's bold venture into hydrogen combustion engines marks a thrilling chapter in the pursuit of eco-friendly automotive power. While challenging, it aligns with a broader industry trend, exemplified by Toyota and Hyundai. The race towards sustainable mobility isn't just about one technology, but a mosaic of innovations. As Porsche navigates technological hurdles, their commitment to a greener future offers consumers exciting choices. Buckle up for a diverse road ahead. If you enjoyed this automotive adventure, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more updates.